This is Dr. Lou Sella, sport performance psychologist. We're going to talk about how Timminsville went from one and nine, and then they did the camp with me. They had 21 players on their roster, and they ended up going to the state semifinals. And they almost won and went to the state championship game. All right, so Timminsville was one and nine once upon a time. And they decided they needed, they needed to go to the triple option offense. So their head coach, I remember, he actually emailed me about doing a camp. And we communicated purely over email. And I went down to Timminsville to do the camp. Now, when I went to do the camp, he did not have a lot of players. He had a few coaches, but he did not have a lot of players. What impressed me about Timminsville was they knew what it was going to take to win before I got there. They were ready to go. And they really set the foundation for the Triple Option Football Academy. They knew the strength of their team had to be the centers and the guards. They had kids that were athletic, but there were like a lot of teams in their conference. They knew they had to create a situation that the centers and the guards could be productive. And they spent a lot of time focusing on those three players. Now, one of the assistant one of the assistant coaches who was very passionate about running triple option, his son was one of the interior offensive linemen. And they went all in on the cylinder. Because they knew they had the skill players. Like they had Skill players that were okay. Now, I found that most places I go, the skill players are okay. The issue is always in the cylinder. So they went all in on making sure their cylinder could block. And what ended up happening was they went from 1-9 to the state semifinals. And they lost in the state semifinals 22-20. to They took an offense that was all over the place, and they put it together. Now, back then, in those days, we ran triple, zone dive, midline lead, toss, counter option, and we threw switch vert Titan. That's 13 years ago. But the impressive thing about Timminsville, the head coach, who I still talk to quite a bit, He's about ready to retire in South Carolina. And his one assistant, they knew that anybody that coached there had to go all in on the cylinder to win. So they did. They coached those kids over and over and over and over and over and over and over. And they won big. And it's really something that everybody can take from this situation. You go all in on your center and two guards with coaching. You coach your tail off. You need to put the proverbial all hands on deck with your cylinder. Watch what happens. The, the quarterback is not as tough as it was back then. Back then, you were, you were running triple option 20 times a game, maybe 30. Now you're running five because of zone dive. Zone dive, the modern day it's run, replaced the the triple option. Triple now is about a five play a game concept. Zone dive back then was what you did to beat number one took the B back and they ran the mic over the top so you'd block him with the tackle and you'd hand the ball off. But the problem with that is the tackle could still get whooped and often did. But they made it work. They did a great job with their cylinder and because of their cylinder they went from one and nine to state semifinals. It's one of the greatest stories that's ever come out of my camp. I actually was talking about it with somebody this weekend. Because I have a lot of great stories. You can find them all at tripleoptionfootball.com slash testimonial. But what Timminsville did with their cylinder is what set them apart. One and nine to the state semifinals. Great story. Did it right before 4th of July weekend many years ago but I'll be honest with you if you do that now 
you're going to really change the trajectory of your football program. If you put three coaches on the cylinder, if you're able to do that, watch what happens to your football program. Watch what happens to your triple option offense. Something to think about. Hey, if you want to be a testimonial, it's time to pick up the phone, give me a call, become a client today. And I'll have you on that testimonial page at the end of the year because you won big in 2024, and then you can thank me later. Help people win every year. Timmonsville is one of many. See you in the next video. Talk soon.